Hey guys, and welcome back. As you can see, I'm on the beach again. Got sunglasses on. Uh, it's beautiful this week. So let's make the most of it and get in out. And uh, I've got the legend. And I'm at a bit where I've not been since last year. Um, so yeah, as you can see, it's just full of rocks. I've had coins here, rings, 50 cal, um, bullet shells, just loads of bullets. So yeah, let's see how the legend holds up in this sort of bit. There's a lot of iron around here, stones and bits like that, so... I hope you can hear me alright, because I have forgot my microphone. But because it's a nice day, there's not much wind, so fingers crossed uh, it'll sound alright. So yeah, I'll see you on the first signal. legend since the update so I'll be getting to grips with it today and seeing how the my problem was a, a ground tracking bug so it froze only once but yeah I'd like to see if that's any different so beach multi wet A noise cancel and I'm 20 sensitivity 28 that is my go-to settings that I'm comfortable with and it works fine for me obviously yeah you might have to tweak it here and there depending on your beach but yeah for me that's that's good so let's crack on with it right before I get started I do want to show you how quiet the legend is. There's quite a few videos where people haven't set it up right and it's just chirping away and then they're moaning about it. But yeah, if you set up a machine, right, it's fine. There's gonna be little chirps here and there, but we're in the water. There's nothing too much. If I turn the sensitivity down a little bit, it, it probably would be a bit more quiet. But as you can see, no problem. It's chirping because there's targets and iron and bits of crap. But apart from that, it's fine. First signal's on the top. Looks like a bulb from the illuminations. <laughs> what signal is that? Bit weird. That's random though. That's what that is. Bulb from the illuminations. So yeah, I just thought I'd show you that. It does work, no matter what people say. Cool, let's find a signal. Right, we have our first signal here. 56, 58, those sort of numbers. Right there, so I'm gonna dig it. We'll right, see what it is. It. Out, so we'll see what is together. Look at that. Bit of a uh, bit of copper. Did well to pick that up. It's quite deep. Yeah. Interesting. Look at that for a fossil, guys. Absolutely covered. So those are little crinoid stems. It's really cool that. Cool. Gonna bring it back, polish it up. Right, we've got another signal here. Solid signal. 44, 46. So we'll dig it. Right, it is in here. I just missed it. It is there. Hopefully it's something good. It's nice to be at this bit again. Not been for ages. 
Got to be out on it. Yeah. What is that? A bit of something. Looks like there could be something under it. It could be brass or something, but it's just like congealed with crap. But yeah, we'll we'll smash that up later because it's looking like that some bronze underneath. I think. I reckon that's going to be a Victorian umbrella piece. Right, next signal, it's a solid one. Best one I've had all day. There it is. 25, 26. We are sort of on top of clay around here as well. Clay and water now. Below the rocks. Let's see what that is. Alright guys, I've got it out and I can see a rim. Um, I'm excited now. That's definitely it. 26, 28. It's in the clay. In the water. Doesn't matter. Let's give it a dunk. There you go. And it'll be fine. As long as you shake it up, get the water out of the speaker, it'll be right. Right, let's see this now. Right, give me one second. I think I've calmed down after finding that gold ring. I really didn't expect that. I thought it was going to be a junker because I've had quite a few junkers here in the past. Oh, absolutely buzzing. Tell you what though, since the update, this seems a lot more stable. Right, next signal as well. 44, let's dig it. Ooh. Hey, absolutely buzzing. Right, we're out. Just seen something in there. Ah, furniture fitting piece or something. 44 that. Yeah, that gold ring was uh, like a solid 25. Oh, I can't believe I just found it. Absolutely over the moon. Cool. Need a coin now. Right, next, next signal out. If it sounds really good and clear, I'll uh, dig it first. Well, show you first the numbers and then get it out. But Sounded a bit iffy that, but dug it out and solid 32 now, so what could this be? Ah, oh, absolutely buzzing. Never found anything like that around this bit before with the gold ring. Proper buzzing light. See that thing there? Surely it's not that. Ah! It's a bit of lead. It's a flattened bullet. Haha, <laughs> cool! Awesome! Happy with that? Proper squished potato bullet. Cool! Set that up. Pretty much on the surface. Nearly blew my head off. Um. <laughs> I don't even want to. Wah. 43. But really, really loud. Yeah, it's just like a brass cap off summit. Wasn't deep. Cool. Right, next signal here. Solid. Solid 37. 
Let's dig it. Uh, foiled by a big bit of aluminium. This is really interesting, right? I had a signal there. It's a bit weird. It's like a solid 11. But it's a bit bitty. If that makes... Well, that probably doesn't make any sense, but it's a bit uh, a bit of a weird signal, but I can see it. There is something there, whatever that is. Ooh. Snapped whatever it is. It could possibly be silver, that as well. Ah, oh, what a day. Might not be though, but it's looking like it. I'd have to check it for hallmarks or something. Snap though anyway, uh, which is a shame, but I don't know what the hell that could be. Yeah, awesome. <laughs> signal here on the clay 53 I can't imagine it being deep on the clay I never know so I'm going to take a bit of a work I think right, I got it. that took like 15 minutes. <laughs> Bloody copper nail. Ugh, scary Next signal in the water. Really loud signal. Uh, solid 44 fishing weight. Cool. Next up, another solid signal. 42 or 43. Uh, another fishing weight. Had any coins yet? Let's try and find some coins. Uh, I'll just show you the numbers. It was the same in the ground. Thirty-one. I don't know why it is. I can just see maybe brass, something brass. Oh no way! It's a military button. Oh, get in! Look at that. Wow, man. That's got to be the best condition one I've ever found. I mean, it's missing the back. But wow, jeez, man. That is amazing. <laughs> cool. Happy days. There we have our next signal. Sounds good. Another 32 number. Yeah, it's a bit... Bit jumpy, but I thought it too, you know. But we'll dig it anyway because it sounds all right. Let's have a look. Right, so it sounds a bit iffy, but I, th I think I can see it. Yeah, it does sound a bit weird. I think I can see where it flopped out. There. Um. No idea. That was a bullet casing for a second. Ah, oh, I know why it is. It's probably a, probably an old little light bulb end, isn't it? Ah. <laughs> Got me excited that then. Hey guys, right I've had a fishing weight, well I've had quite a few fishing weights, quite a few coins and a threepenny bit. I have just kept going at it, um, I've been stopped by loads of people as well so a few people see me dig some coins which is cool, that might get them hooked on the hobby but uh, I'm going to cut it short now because I've, I've just had some news um, so yeah I'm cutting the video. Hey guys, right on the way home now, um, absolutely knackered so 
found that gold ring. I couldn't believe it. Absolutely over the moon. And then I think a bit of a silver earring as well. And then a load of coins and stuff. Just on our way home, there's my son. You gonna say hello? Yeah. <laughs> you gonna wave bye? Bye. <laughs> Catch you on the next one guys. Take care.